this isn't gonna change anything, but still. And I've made videos like this before, but it felt like sharing again. But um, so two days in a row, the pickles that I like to eat um, have a um, a bitterness and a, a flavor that smells very much like the smell of nail polish or something along those lines. <clears throat> And I know you could be like, oh, you have schizophrenia, so it's like, we can't trust anything you say. You could be just making, like, dreaming this up or whatever, like, it's all in your head. But, like, I can say with certainty that there have been times where I get something that's off. Or I'll be, I'll eat, like, the first little bit of something, and then someone adds something into it later. And it's like, wait, it's like, wow, now this is very bitter, or wow, this is very salty. There have been times where I have a glass of water and it's got a super bitterness and then I swallow it and it burns my chest going down and then later in that day that specific time I had like a serious like anxiety and rage to where it's like I felt like I was gonna like lose my mind but um yeah I'm certain that these things have happened and like I've never fucked with anyone's food this way I would never do this to anyone I like let alone I wouldn't I wouldn't fucking do anything mindfully to make anyone uncomfortable, let alone fucking, like, add something toxic or, like, a drug or something to someone's food. And the thing is, I don't get it because it's like, who could this be? And I fucking, like, I really care about the only people that I live with. And, like, I'm very close to people and everything, so it's kind of like there could be some secretive bullshit. Like, I don't get it. Like, someone's holding a really dumb grudge or something. But, again, I've never killed anyone. I've never fucking assaulted anyone. I've never broken anyone's trust in such a way where, like, someone... You'd even think that someone would be like, yeah, let's fucking, like, drug them or fuck with their food. And, yeah, now I... I ate a few of those anyway, and I was like, fuck it, like, I don't have any more pickles, so I'm gonna eat some. I've got, I do seem to be getting abdominal pain, so it's like, I'm just saying, I just want to throw this out there. I don't need, like, fucking, uh, I mean, there have been times it's like, yes, I am going to get fucking cameras, but it's like, that's, fu that's fucked up. Like, even though I do, obviously it's fucked up to fuck with someone's food in any way. To Even if it was just, like, someone being like, you're gonna eat meat, you vegan, or some shit. Like, depending, like, whatever it is. But this has a very strong, like, painty flavor. Like, the smell, like, of that noxious, like, it's like when you open up nail polish. And maybe, just maybe, I w actually, no, no. I would say that maybe it's just, like, a bad batch of apple cider vinegar. But I already used some of it before, and it was fine for a while. So, like, and vinegar doesn't really go bad. And, like, we just opened it. It's a giant thing of it that we just <coughs> opened. Yeah, I've got a weird... Now I feel like... I've got, like, a stuck burp feeling. I don't wish this on anyone. I don't, like, I mean... <laughs> I would never fucking do anything like this to anyone, so... And maybe, yeah, again, I'm not saying each time... I'm not saying this specific time is definitely someone fucking with my food. <sighs> but I know as a fact <clears throat> my food has been fucked with before. And again, I have never drugged anyone. I have never fucking poisoned anyone or added anything that tastes bad or tried to be like, this is going to taste like shit for your next time or anything. I've never done that to anyone. And I would never do that to any person. Like... That's not my idea of fucking, like, even if it was, like, a terrible person, that's not the way you go about justice. And I'm not a fucking terrible person. Sometimes I might feel like it. But again, the worst thing I've ever done in this lifetime is, I don't even know if it happened or not, because it was back when I was using heroin. I had smoked cannabis with a friend, and then I did heroin and had some drinks. So that combo, I was very out of it. And I think I may have grabbed a girl's butt which is not okay. Like, I recognize that. That is by far the worst thing I've ever done. I have... I've had similar things like that, only worse happen to me. And I would never do anything to anyone based on that. But, um... I, and and I, I know, it's fucking assault. What I did was... I saw it in a way... So, I may have actually... Yes, I may have actually assaulted someone in that way. Like, grabbed a girl's butt cheek without asking when I was really fucked up. But, um... 
I still don't know because she never said anything. She never came to me and was like, why did you do that or anything? So for all I know, I was just really out of it in like thinking about things or something. I don't know. It's very hazy. It's never okay to do that, obviously, only with consent, only with mutual attraction and everything. But I, I'm a very honest person and I will always say like, if anyone asks me, I will be up front and say like, this is who I am. This is the, here's my worst fucking things I've ever committed and everything. Here's all this about myself. And I can be a creep and everything in different ways, but I'm not like, I'm not mindfully, intentionally choosing to harm anyone or make anyone uncomfortable. There was just that one time where maybe I did that and again, I feel remorse for it. If it, whether or not it happened, I still have no, you know, closure on that, whether or not that actually happened. <clears throat> But still, like, even if that happened, like, I don't deserve to, if this is what it is, if I'm eating, ingesting, um, nail polish or nail polish remover or whatever, like, no, that's some sadistic fucking garbage. Like, I understand, like, I don't know. But anyway, um, just thought I'd share that. But I'm gonna, here, I've got some food. This should be some okay food because it's a different sort of thing but anyway i love you all i wish you pleasant days i don't wish i hope nobody you hey don't fuck with people's food ever unless there's maybe there's some if you can like save lives if it's like this guy we know as a fact this guy is going to go on a killing spree like somehow like oh this guy's planning on killing a whole bunch of people later and you can like save like a group of people like some weird theoretical shit or um not theoretical, um, you know what I mean, I can't think of the word, but yeah, anyway, uh, I love you all, I wish you pleasant days, uh, yeah, you don't deserve, you deserve to feel well, and you deserve to grow, and, uh, I hope you have healthy days, many happy, long life with ha happy, healthy days, <clears throat>